Now, we've been bringing you many views from the Livestock Show and Rodeo here in Mercedes. So we saw some cows, we saw some games and some fun with the carnival rides. But now we're in another section of the Livestock Show, and I'm joined by an FFA advisor, Doug Denny, and also by one of the competitors, Ryan Keller. And he's also brought his his pet back there or his, his, his animal with him. But Doug, I want to start with you. Tell me about FFA and what it takes to be an advisor and how you help the students. All right, so FFA is, is a student organization. It's student led. Uh, it's to teach them leadership skills and things like that to better their lives and, and, and keep them going and things like that. Uh, being an advisor, it's, it's actually an awesome job because I get to work with students all the time. They're just as passionate as, the, as, as us about learning about the animals, whether it be a cow, or steer or heifer or uh, pig for that matter. All right, Ryan, now I know this isn't your first competition. Tell me about how the first one went and what the plan is now on this second one. So like the first one, it was like my first time going in, I was super nervous, but then, you know, a bunch of other people, they calmed me down because like, you know, like the community, you know, it's just like everybody like helps each other out and coming to this one, I'm a lot more, you know, confident in myself and working with her, you know, it's a lot more easier. Awesome, all right, so we're gonna get a quick shot of Tootsie, um, but we have so much more to talk about here from the Livestock Show. Now, there's also eight PSJA North High School students competing this year. One of the students competing is Samara Garza. She's a senior at PSJA North. Now, Garza will be showing a lamb this year. She says she's been working with her lamb for two hours a day for the past nine months. Aside from her passion of showcasing animals, Garza says she joined FFA to be part of something much larger. It's not just about raising animals. You have life skills. You have speech development events. You have everything that can have, help you out. Now, today's, competi today's competition will focus on goats and chicken competitions. And you can stick here on CBS4 for much more and on the rodeo and the livestock show.